So welcome again uh, to the stat solving exercises. So we have reached exercise six, and they're asking us to compute the average of all the number on the stack. So we have a stack, and we have these numbers. So we need the average. So in order to do the average, we need to sum all these elements, and then we need to divide the sum by the number of elements. So we have already written the sum function. So let's repeat it quickly. So we need to take this one, the first element, and add it to sum, then pop it, and then take the newest top element and then pop it, and then the newest top and pop it. Now the stack is empty, so while top popping and topping, uh, we need to count the number of elements, so we count 1, 2, 3, and then we divide it by 3, and we can find the uh, average. So it is the main function, so average should take the stack, and the return value should be of type uh, real, so it could be float double or long double, since we have uh, an average, so we have a division. So we need to look over the stack. So we will be using the top as an address of an element. So for this, we will be declaring an element E. So as long as we have a top, I'll pop it. And so in pop, we'll need an address. And since as is passed as value, we need to add the ampersand. So I will add the element. So sum plus equal to E. And I need to declare sum and initialize it to 0 and also I need to count the element so I will be using also a variable called count and I will initialize it to 0 2 so when I when the the stack is uh, empty so I can return the uh, average so it's equal to sum over count however there's a problem here since sum is an integer and count is an integer, so one of these should be uh, of uh, type double. So either I can multiply by 1.0 or I can use casting. So I'm casting. So what happens here if the stack is empty? So we'll have 0 over 0 and we'll have a problem. So let's consider that the stack is never empty. So let's run it. And we will end with 10 over 3 is equal to 3.3. And this is done for exercise uh, 6. So if you have any questions, do not hesitate to send it to me by email and to subscribe to this channel and to hit the bell icon to receive notifications and check all the links below uh, in the video description to check the list of exercises and the link for the course. Thanks for watching.